HDN network is basically stands means uh, software defined network and we can we need to use it for convenience of data transmission from the client to the server and from the server to the client it is a efficient method for sending and getting the request from the server so the main idea is that the client is uh, going to send the request which is going through the data plane and the data plane is something which consists of many switches and all the switches are interconnected to each other and these whole data plane and switches are connected to the controller the control is the main part which plays the role in the HDN network. It is the centralized controller where all the switches, what we call switches or data planes or the client, any, everything is controlled by the controller. And the controller then send, to, send the request to the application plane where the application plane is something where it is connected to the server and it will check whether the requ request is valid or it is sent to the server or it will send, check something uh, from the controller protocols and from there it will go to the server and server will check the authentication passwords and the user details which user is authenticating or whatever may be and the server will give the permission whether to access or not and that re response is going to the controller and the controller will send the response to the client through the switches of the data plane or it can directly send through the client through open flow protocol. So this is the main idea of HDN network. I have understood better about data plane as well as about the information like how we'll get the information uh, from the Google and how I am asking the question and how I am getting the response. Uh, it is a very efficient method. By this method I can learn uh, very much more than from the theoretical.